Welcome back heroes to some more Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Last episode, Goku has finally arrived on Namek just in the nick of time because Ginyu Force also arrived and they've um, beaten up uh, Krillin, Gohan and Vegeta pretty badly. Well, just one of the members. Gohan and Krillin managed to take out the weakest member of the Ginyu Force, but there's still uh, some pretty strong members left. And Freeza now has all the seven Dragon Balls, which is not good at all. Kakarot, you finally show your face. Gohan, here you go. It's a sensu bean. Give some to the others, too. I'm gonna fight these guys on my own. Ha! You wanna fight me? What's a puny little guy like you gonna do? There's no way you can beat me! There isn't. Okay. Ooh, Vegeta got some XP. Nice. Gohan got some XP. Lay our supports. No, it's just us. Okay, okay. Dodge all this. Actually, wait. Oh, you're still going? Oh, okay, okay. It's fine, it's fine. Just dodge. Ooh, just dodge that. Nice. Ow, and I got hit with that. Great. Alright, finally start doing some, oh not spirit bomb, did not want to try and do that, that would be a bad time to do that. Ow, 26,000, he does a lot of damage. Okay, we might be tough, but he is also very tough. Oh no, this way, this way, this way, this way. Okay. Uh, I can't get out of it. Okay. No, dude, he's got some hundred. I thought it was fourteen thousand. No, he's got a lot of HP. It's gonna be a long battle. Right. I don't think we have to go Kyrie Ken at all. No. Just checking. I still have. Oh, let's check that. Right, and I thought I could maybe bring up as well. I can bring up that point. I do have um, a bit of drinks, so we're good. Or fire drinks. Keep on a bit of drinks, but it matter, does it? Uh, we need to go probably this. Okay, this move just deletes HP. And while you're there, watch one of them. Nice, nice. Not today, my dude. I need to get... I guess I've got this. Ooh. I need more, like, super uh, melee moves. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to get hit by that. And this again. And it's going to go up top. Ow, ow, I'm stuck. Alright. Oh no, oh no. He's done him hit me. Oh, I can dodge that. Okay, it's fine. That's the last bit of. Last bit of damage. I think we can just. Cannot get hit by that. Oh. 
And finish him off, hopefully. There you go. Nice. Oh, look at that XP. Alright. I think it's finally time to show you my best stuff. Sorry, you were wide open, so I just went for it. You, you, you. <laughs> Damn, how is this possible? He's already gone beyond a Saiyan power level. What kind of training has he put himself through to achieve this? <laughs> Wait, are the stories more than legends? Could it possibly be? Is he the legendary Saiyan warrior that appears once every thousand years? Is he actually a Super Saiyan? What about you guys? You gonna go back to your own planet or what? Or do you want to end up like this guy over here? Whoa, you hear that bird, huh? This spiky head whip must be out of his mind. Yeah. He actually believes that he has the power to take down Raccoon. Oh, he just got lucky. Raccoon wasn't fighting at his best, that's all. Yeah, that was a fluke. I mean, his power level didn't even go over 5,000. Give me a break. Here we go! Yeah! Right, both of you guys at once? So you won't go back, huh? Okay. Oh, I should probably just quickly take a drink. I should probably take a large one. Or not. Oh, no, I did. Okay. I thought like a little thing was going to come saying, take a drink. Or, like a little bit, but nope. It's fine. Nope. Okay. Oh, nope. I'm just missing all the moves. This is bad. Okay. Okay, okay, just gonna dodge a few moves. Let's go. Nope. Oh, I actually hit me still. You're coming right at me, dude. You're gonna come in a straight line then, you know, it's only fair I do that. Real quick. Nope. I thought I'd get that off. I did. Nice. Dude, you are in for it now. Okay. He says, and then. Woo! Oh, okay. He just ate that. Right, I need to prefer it now. Oh, am I hitting both of them? Oh! He's got a little bit unlucky. He's been, like, kind of just behind me a little bit. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, almost there. Oh, no. Missed me. And now you're gone. Alright. Just this dude left. Now, one on one. I don't think we should have any problems. Oh, Goku just roasting them. Like, you guys are like, you know, quite you know, famous around the universe of, you know, being powerful warriors, but I don't know what, you, I don't think you know what you're doing. Uh oh. Nope. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, let's drink a little drink. Oh, 
Huh. Yeah, exactly. Uh oh. I want, I might, oh, I don't know where you went. There. No, that's the tree. Uh, not you. What I might try and do is let's power up real quick. I'm not sure if we can actually do it. Oh, we can. There's 132. Right, so if I can just back up, I want to try the spirit bomb. Ooh, not actually that bad. Because there's a lot of keto. Oh, cool. Easy. Hey, level 28. Kakarot's rapidly increasing his power level at the exact moment he lands a strike. He, he must be trying to conserve his energy. That power spike is probably too quick for even their advanced scouters to detect. His power level is unbelievable. How can... Where is all this power coming from? Do you understand now? Just give up already. And leave this planet. Uh, uh, this must be some sort of nightmare. How can we elite warriors be so p -p powerless against this guy? Your naivete makes me sick. Why would you let them get away with that? You may have grown stronger, but that doesn't make you a Super Saiyan. Far from it. Super Saiyan? I can see that you're proud of how much you've increased your power, but that won't be nearly enough to defeat Frieza. Frieza, huh? That's the guy King Kai told me about. Wait, so even after all the training I did, you're saying I'm still not strong enough to beat him? That's exactly what I'm telling you. Frieza possesses more power than you could ever possibly imagine. Uh, maybe you're wrong. I mean, you saw what Goku can do, right? I mean, those guys couldn't even lay a finger on him. Goku is unstoppable. Then fight him and find out for yourself. But that's not all. Frieza's probably already used the Dragon Balls to wish for immortality. No, I, I don't think he's done that yet. What? How would you know? Well, if it's like using the Dragon Balls on Earth, the sky should get really dark and Shinron appears. But it's been bright this whole time, which means he probably hasn't made his wish yet. Shen what? What the heck's a Shenron? You mean something comes out of the Dragon Balls? Oh, yeah, that's right. He probably doesn't know how to summon Shenron. That means we still have a chance to make our wish. Hooray! <laughs> Appears we've got some company arriving. Looks like Jace has brought Captain Ginyu along with him. Wait, where's Frieza? I thought for sure he'd be back at his ship with the Dragon Balls that Captain Ginyu brought him. I'm sensing some massive energy over there. That's gotta be Frieza. Uh, over there? Oh, we're in big trouble now. That's where Guru is. Oh no, Frieza's probably gonna force Guru to tell him how to make a wish with the Dragon Balls. <laughs> Yeah, and once he's figured that out, he's gonna kill Guru for sure. He doesn't know that he won't be able to use the Dragon Balls if Guru dies. What? That settles it. Krillin and Gohan, you two get the Dragon Balls. Me and Vegeta will go stop Frieza. Right. And if we don't hurry, Guru is done for. We have to find Bulma and get the Dragon Radar. Yeah, good idea. Good luck, guys. And be careful. Goku! Go get him! Come on, Vegeta, let's go. We're gonna go greet those Ginyu guys. Fine. And this is where the beautiful friendship was made. <laughs> You're probably a lot stronger now that you've recovered from a near-death experience. <laughs> so you know about that, huh? Right. Ooh. Get some Wait. orbs. Neither Freeze nor Ginyu are back at the ship. Then that means the ship's completely defenseless right now. <laughs> you 
You've got some real guts, you know that? The cat was gonna make you pay for what you did. Dearly. So this is the guy, huh? His power level's around 5,000. Just like we said. Makes no sense, right? Absurd. Relying too much on your scouter is a rookie mistake. Don't be a fool. Most likely, he has the ability to instantly increase his power. From what I can tell, I'd say his true power level is somewhere around 60,000. 60,000? I don't have that much power? Promising. This'll be an enjoyable battle, the first in a long time. All right, let's do this, Vegeta. You take that smaller guy over there. Kakarot and Ginyu are more or less equal in terms of power. If I'm lucky enough, maybe the two of them might take each other out. This is the end of the line for you. Farewell, Kakarot! Vegeta, here I go! It's so weird to be like the CVG and not trying to, you know, be like, no, I'll take the bigger guy. Always trying to run up um, Goku, but. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, this is gonna be tough. Okay. Oh, no, oh, no. Ooh. Okay, okay, I don't know what damage, right? I'm gonna go Kyrie Ken till we take out the Jace. Oh my god, stop! I can't even get to him. Don't give me a chance to move! Okay, I gotta revert back, on. Huh? Right. Can get both of you in. Nope. Oh, can you won't let me just get to him? sucks. Okay, 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 okay. Yes, got ya. Uh, 10k damage and... No, no, okay. Just stop me in it. Right, got them both. I think I knocked him out. Now it's just Ginyu. Woo! Right. Uh, let's drink up. Full HP. And for this, I think we go Kaioken. Count at the end there, 257,000 XP. Level 30. Uh, are, are you? No, no, you can't be. Are you? 
Are you a Super Saiyan? Vegeta said something about that too. I have no idea what you guys are talking about. S S Super Saiyan? You mean... You mean... The legendary warrior? No! This cannot be! Is, is this guy really the only thing in the universe that even Lord Frieza is afraid of? I don't know about that, but what I do know is that I'd like to avoid fighting if I can. So listen up. Just leave the planet. I'm saying this for your own good. What? Are you joking? No, I'm serious. I don't want to kill you guys if I don't have to. I've heard that the Super Saiyan is the ultimate warrior. One that lives only for battle and bloodshed. Oh, oh I get it. You're not actually a Super Saiyan, are you? But be that as it may, your power is still far greater than my own power. <laughs> What's funny? Jace, take my scouter. What, what are you doing? <laughs> body of yours is pretty strong. Yes, and I think I'll take it! Change! Not bad, not bad. <laughs> what? What's going on? What? what? What am I doing all the way over there? We've made a trade. Your body is mine now. Hey, Captain, here's your scouter. Right. Now, back to the ship. It's possible Lord Frieza may have returned already. <laughs> So this is why he damaged his own body. It all makes sense now. I'm in serious trouble. If I don't hurry, I'm... Wait, no. He's gonna meet up with Krillin and the others. That's it. Wait a second. Even if I make it back to Earth... Chi-Chi probably wouldn't be all too happy seeing me the way I am right now. <laughs> he seems to have sniffed us out. It won't be much longer until he's here. You must go, Dinle. Unhurry. Those Earthlings need you. Grand Elder Guru? I suppose I let this one live. There's no sense wasting my time with a single speck of dust. What do you want? Greetings and salutations. My name is Frieza, and I've come to your humble little planet in search of the Dragon Balls. Fear not, as I have already managed to gather all seven of them. Though it would seem I am unable to draw upon their power, which is what brings me to the lot of you. Tell me what I must do in order to grant my wish. I suggest you leave. We have no intention of telling monsters like you. I would be more forthcoming if I were you. Although I do not intend to kill you, I will use force if necessary. There are two of you, yes? I don't care which one of you it is, but one of you will tell me. Fine. If that's how it's going to be, then we'll fight. But know this. Grand Elder Guru, the creator of the Dragon Balls, resides here. 
If you kill him, the Dragon Balls will disappear as well. Hmm. Neil, my son, you must hold him off as long as you can. Understood, my lord. I see. But I'm curious. Don't you wonder if he'll still refuse to tell me what I need to know when he sees that you're about to die? I won't go down as easy as you think. But we're not going to fight here. Grand Elder Guru doesn't have much longer to live. Fighting here would only hasten his end. Oh, <laughs> very well then. Oh my, that's quite impressive. You've somehow managed to raise your power level to 42,000. Such a feat for the likes of you. But just to give you a sense of scale, allow me to inform you of what you're truly up against. My power level, you see, is 530,000. Rest assured, however, I haven't the slightest intention of fighting you with my full power. How kind of me. That's enough! Dragon Balls. They're either hidden somewhere, or Frieza's holding on to them. Wherever they are, those Earthlings are sure to find them with that contraption of theirs. But before they get the chance, I must mask my power. They'll quickly realize I'm here otherwise. This should work. Once those runs summon that Shenron creature, I'll kill them and get my wish granted. It won't be long until I run into them. I should change into a new battle suit while I have the chance. All right, let's go. Like Any side quest to do? Nope. Right, right, is it worth eating a meal or something right now? They've got plenty of boost still going for us, so it's fine. Radar showing that the Dragon Balls aren't in the ship, but somewhere near it. Looks like no one's around. Now's our chance to look for the Dragon Balls. buried them in the ground huh. we've got all of them now ah so that's where they are hurry and summon that shenron creature you fools once that thing makes an appearance i'll trash the kids and finally make my wish for immortality Harunga appears well here goes right come forth shenron and grant our wishes Nothing happened. What's going on? Where's... Where's Shinron? Maybe the phrase you use is different to summon him here. Damn it. What the hell are those two doing? Quillen, someone's coming this way. <laughs> yeah, there's two of them. And they got some wicked power. One of them's that Ginyu guy. D does, does that mean my dad lost? <laughs> what the... Goku... Did you beat Ginyu and befriend one of his men or something like that? Whoa, they dug up the Dragon Balls! How did you do that? What do you mean? Obviously, we used the Dragon Radar. The Dragon Radar? So, did you already make your wish? Well, it's the craziest thing. We tried to summon Shinron, but it just won't work. Uh, you know, there's something different about you, Goku. I can't quite place it. That's a scouter, isn't it? Why are you wearing one of those, Goku? Krillin! That's not my dad! Huh? Gohan, what do you mean it's not your dad? Uh, I don't know how to explain it, but I know it's not him! This body no longer belongs to that Saiyan! I couldn't resist its power, so I took it! Wait, what did you say? <sighs> mm hmm? And you're... Krillin! Go on! That's not me! <laughs> wow, you actually made it this-
this far. That's correct. I am the mighty leader of the Ginyu Force, Captain Ginyu! <laughs> no, it can't be. That's my dad? He swapped bodies. All this really complicates things. Go on. Freelan, I know you two have what it takes to get rid of this guy. Don't hold anything back. Really let him have it. I can't. You're talking as if you think they can win. Remember, this is your body. Yeah. You're right about one thing. That's my body, not yours. As long as my mind is separated from it, you can't unleash the full power it's capable of. You fool. The great Captain Ginyu will not fall for such tricks. Let me join in a fight, Captain. Or I could totally make these low lives suffer. Trust me. Well then, if you're looking for a fight, why don't you try me on for size? Vegeta! We... When did you... Alright. When I was a kid, man, the switching body things really messed me up. I thought it was so freaky. I remember what happens, but... Or how it ends. I swear, like, does Bulma get involved in the body switcher? I could have sworn she does. Well, I guess we'll find out soon enough. Ooh. At the moment, honestly, I think I most prefer um, fighting with Gohan. Of all the combos I got, like, I think it's just... Okay. All the stuff I got, it's just... He's the best. Okay, you know, I'm gonna just... Uh... Nope, I'm gonna do that. It's really annoying, like, every time I have Krillin, it's um, R1 and Triangle, but whenever you get someone else, Krillin gets pushed down. So I went for R1 Triangle, that's just Vegeta. <laughs> Oops. Alright. Oh. Knock you down. Woo! Breaking that boulder, man. Nice. Oh, no. Oh, again, you had to come and just ruin everything, didn't you? Oh, I had to go Solar Flare. Oh, this guy's gonna get finished off now. There you go. And now it's just you. It's fine, it's fine. Oh, okay. Thank you, Vegeta. Go body smash, we can get that off. Nice. Right, I need to get a little bit of cheese. Oh, yeah, we're good. And you almost. Oh, nice. Yeah, get wrecked. Having two supports is so nice. Ooh, look at that XP, like quarter million. Vegeta, we're all done for. 
not good. Now, your body is mine, Vegeta! Perfect! happened yes I did it I turned him into a frog to use the Dragon Balls. Tell me and I'll put an end to your suffering. I may not be able to kill that elder of yours, but you, on the other hand, are expendable. Consider this your final warning. Tell me how to grant my wish or die! <laughs> it's too late for you. D Dende is on his way. To meet the Earthlings. He, he's going to tell them how to use the Dragon Balls. What? What? A little worm from before. C curse you! You were merely wasting my time, weren't you? I, I'm not picking up a signal from the Ginyu Force. No! All five of them couldn't have! They couldn't have all been defeated! No! Something must have happened between Vegeta, the Earthlings, and the Ginyu Force! And the Dragon Balls! No! I, the Almighty Frieza, will be the only one to make any wishes! Not lower life forms like you! This medical machine here, it should put you back in prime condition before you know it. Oh, and might as well give you some battle suits while we're at it. That way you'll at least be somewhat protected. Huh? Battle suits? You mean like that one? I don't really like how it looks. Whoa, this is crazy! Super lightweight. It feels like I'm not wearing anything at all. Nothing at all. And these shoulder pads don't really get in the way. We have all sorts of room to move. Go on. We should head over to Guru's place while Goku's recovering. If we don't find out how to summon Shenron, then we came all the way out here for nothing. Right. Let's get going. Go find out how to activate the Dragon Balls. I am going to rest up before this fight with Frieza. Uh, okay. Ooh, is that actually a side oh, mission to do? Into him first. Not gonna lie, the, this suit kind of... I think it kind of suits Gohan. The same with Krillin. I don't know about the shoulder pads, but... I don't know, I think mean, it's alright. Let's make sure it's just the one side quest. And... Yeah, just the one side quest. I wonder how long it's gonna take for my dad to fully recover. Ooh, hi. Well, Vegeta said in no time, so... Oh, come on. They gotta be somewhere. The Freezer Force. Damn it, they found me. We gotta take him out. Oh. Uh, take him out before he does anything evil. I bet he's not gonna be evil, but yeah, of course we'll take him out. Oh, Chef Malone. Okay. Alright. You wanna throw down? <laughs> you really wanna fight? Damn it. Throw down or face down? <laughs> Oh, he is. 
Um, yeah. <laughs> About that. No! <laughs> huh? This guy's a pushover. I give up, I give up. You guys win. Just leave me alone. But, but what? You're going to kick a guy when he's down? No, we're not going to do that. So leave me alone, would you? Okay. <laughs> wow, you actually listen to me? Wait, you guys aren't part of the Freezer Force, are you? I don't recognize you. Alright, you probably thought we were because of these uniforms. Jeez, you're trying to trick me or something? But you guys were here to drag me back to the base. So sorry for the confusion. Well, just make sure it doesn't happen again, okay? Seriously, man. Wait, why are we apologizing to him? What's a Freezer Force soldier doing out here? Why does the sight of other soldiers scare you? Like I said before, we are trying to drag me back to the base. I'm a bit of a celebrity chef in the force. You guys heard of me, right? I'm the famous Chef Malone. Sorry, but we haven't heard of you. What? Oh, I guess I need, need to get my name out there a little more. Whatever, the whole reason I joined the force was so I could get dispatched to this planet. You see, on Namek, I've got access to special fruits that can only be found here. I really want to get my hands on some, so I snuck away from the force to look for them. Hmm, so that's why you're worried about being forced to go back. I had no idea Namek had fruit like that. You can see them for yourself if you help me out. I'm not pulling any tricks, I swear. What do you think, Krillin? Knowing you, I bet you really want to help this guy out, huh, Gohan? You look to my ears. Thanks a bunch. Alright, so I'm looking for... Yucca melons. Are just oranges and roller nuts? Um. Looking for those fruits. If I knew, I would be struggling like I am. But according to the computer, the melons can be found in rocky areas. As with the oranges, you're not going to believe this, but they apparently grow on the roots of trees here. Isn't that wild? And the roller nuts? Yeah, roller nuts grow on trees in the highlands and ripen by falling to the ground and rolling away. So you probably find them in a place down away from the trees. No clue where they could be exactly. Mm. They could even be end up rolling to the ocean. Yeah, maybe. Should check it. Check that too. Anyway, find all the fruit and I'll give you a reward. Okay, we'll find these fruits and bring them back I here. Hopefully I found some on my travels so I can just do this quest right away. But I thought there's going to be certain special stuff. Right, start over there. Uh, we got time, probably. Right, so this one's got to be in the ocean. Uh, so, oh, there it is. Woo. All right, one down. Two more to go. Kind of glad it tells us where it is, because, well, a rough idea. Otherwise, we'll be looking for a long, long time. Alright. Uh... Oh, is that another one? Getting quite lucky with these, to be fair. Yucca melon. And lastly, we need the orange. Which was by trees. Oh, there you go. The roots of trees. Done. Right. Easy peasy. Out the way, tree or trees, I say mountains. Just break for everything. Whew. Yo. Hi. We're back, and I think we found everything you're looking for. <laughs> hmm, where to go, guys? Looks like you were the right people for the job. Let's see. Yucca melon, one bite of its succulent f uh, flesh fills the mouth with the most del delectable juice and sends your taste buds to another world. For most people, it's just a tasty fruit. For a certain race, Ina gives them quite the rush. Wow, I had no idea. A just orange, it's almost overwhelmingly sweet fragrance and is complemented with a fresh orange scent. Of course, the flavor is even better. And its soft skin is a delight to eat as well. Plus, it triggers a special reaction in the body that temporarily increases the power of whoever eats it sevenfold, severalfold. Just like the yucca melon, that effect only applies to a certain race. Oh, it's all him. You keep mentioning a certain race. What race are you talking about? You mean you haven't figured it out by now? Wait. That's right, I'm talking about my race. Oh. Okay. This is not good. I wasn't kidding before when I mentioned the effects these fruits have on my body. I don't believe it, he tricked us. Ah, this feels great. Now then, as for you two. Oh, I'm gonna make you the ultimate fruit juice. Huh? Oh, I thought he was going to fight us. My newfound power, I have the strength to crack open this roller nut. 
That's right, I need the yucca melon and the adjusive orange to open the roller nut. But make no mistake, the melon nut had a rich flavour to the juice and the orange fragrant aroma will add a nice finishing touch to the beverage. I honestly thought, I like how this side quest went. Like you think he's going to betray you and fight you, but it's all good. Because my body was extra sensitive to the effects of the fruit. Anyway, I finished making the juice here. Please take it as a token of my gratitude for helping out. Thank you so much. Ooh, that took a lot out of me. I think I'm going to take a little break. Time to come up with another tasty concoction uh, using these ingredients. This guy uh, really likes his food, huh? Yeah, I thought for sure he was going to fight us, though. <laughs> Same here. It's just hard to uh, charge my key. I mean, he clearly looked like he was scheming something. He and his laugh sounded really evil. Why are you staring at me? Cut it out. I know I'm a famous chef, but you're making me blush. <laughs> oh, man. I like this guy. Okay. Let's be on our way to the main mission, then. Whoop. And we still have lots of... I'm going to quickly save the game as well, because I feel like it's been a while. Just in case, you know. Uh, the last actual save I did was when uh, we ended the last episode. Uh, this is a little auto save we had, but it's always good to do a manual save here and there. Just in case. Right, let's get that. Oh. Yeah! Love doing that so much. Oh. Take us straight to the uh, main mission. collected the dragon balls but we can't do anything with them so we thought we'd head to guru's place and ask him what to do i knew it this is perfect grand elder guru told me to find you two and tell you how to use the dragon balls you won't be able to make a wish unless you say it in the namekian language namekian huh i guess that would explain why it didn't work before we need to hurry grand elder guru doesn't have much time Frieza might be on his way here as we speak. Uh, right. Oh yeah, what about Vegeta? He said he was gonna rest up, right? Yeah. He's probably still sleeping. Good. We gotta make sure we're extra stealthy on the way back. Vegeta. Uh, he's still sleeping. Well, he's been in his fair share of battles recently. Now's our chance to leave him here and go make our wishes. We gotta grab the Dragon Balls and make our way out of here without waking him up. Even if Shenron wakes him up, we should still have enough time if we're far enough away. All right. Looks like Vegeta doesn't even know we're here. Yeah. Huh. Someone's coming this way. Th they're super fast. Huh? <laughs> it's Frieza. Hurry, Dente. Do what you need to do to help us make our wishes. R right. Takarato popurunga pufrito paro. They're glowing. Getting dark! Just like the Dragon Balls on Earth! You who have gathered all seven Dragon Balls, now state your wishes. I shall grant you any three wishes that are within my power. Whoa! That Namekian Shinron is one generous dragon! Hurry! Tell me your wishes before Vegeta or Frieza get here! Oh, uh, right. First, ask him to bring back everyone on Earth who was killed by the Saiyans. Banda Parura, Ruti Mararu, Ban Paritsu, Kumera Tohero, Runchiro, Itash Kunchpa, Pontero, Rupche! I am unable to grant that wish. 
I am only capable of bringing back one person at a time. They can only wish back one person at a time. Hey, let me talk to Gohan. Hurry! Okay, okay. Place your hand on my shoulder to talk to him. Thanks. Gohan, can you hear me? It's Piccolo! Mr. Piccolo? Listen up and listen good, okay? I know what's going on there. That first wish of yours, use it to bring me back. If I'm back, then Kami will be as well. You have to trust me on this. We can use the Dragon Balls on Earth to resurrect everybody else. We can bring them back. Yeah, that's right. I totally forgot about that. And as for the second wish, you have to make him send me to Namek. I want to make that wretched Frieza suffer slowly for slaughtering my people. I'm a lot stronger now thanks to the training I've done. I know I can beat him. You have to warp me to Namek. Okay, Mr. Piccolo. Good. Do whatever you want for the third wish. Dinde. Ask him if he can bring back Piccolo. He was a Namekian that used to be on Earth. Okay, you said his name was Piccolo, right? Petorapto Hoto Piccolo, Pupi Mero Papi Moposo, Patorate Morimpe, Kuri Pupas, Kuya Kirigo, Oloteku Horoksa, Pero Pupo! Understood. I will grant your first wish. Kame! Piccolo, what is this? What in the world are you up to? For our second wish, please ask him to take Piccolo, the guy we just brought back, and then warp him straight here to Namek. Okay! Harumopara Akororu Senonithoro Hikoloru Magaka Tanakaroru! Consider it done. I shall grant your second wish. So, this is Planet Namek, the home of my people. Not sure why, but there's something familiar about it. Now's not the time to get emotional. I need to find Gohan and the others. I'm sensing a massive energy in the distance. Oh. It must be that monster, Frieza. I sense three huge powers near there. They've got to be Gohan and the others. I was going to say, I remember Piccolo being on Namek, but I obviously he was dead. I was like, how does he get there? Now, now it all makes sense. I thought for sure Frieza was on his way here. But what the hell is going on? Why is it dark outside? There's no night on this planet. <laughs> what the hell is that monstrosity? Those Dragon Balls and those twerps, they're gone. That beast must be the Shenron creature those two were talking about. Ugh, I can't believe they took the Dragon Balls right from under my nose. Damn them! Your second wish has been granted. Now, state your final wish. Wait, he granted our wish? Then where's Piccolo? Well, you did ask to have him sent to this planet, but but you didn't say where. D did you want me to have him sent here? No, now what are we supposed to do? Uh. Uh. Oh, you actually thought you can trick me? You're going to pay for that! How could you be so stupid? 
Get it through your head! Frieza can't be defeated unless I'm immortal! W wait We get three wishes! So that means... There's still one left! W what are you doing, Gohan? Well, now that's what I like to hear. Now then, make me immortal! Frieza's already on his way here! Hold on! Do you not have a final wish? Oh man, we're out of options at this point. Hurry, Tinpei, grant Vegeta's wish! I hate to admit it, but he's our best shot at getting out of this mess. Okay, I'll ask Harunga. Yes, finally! Frieza has no hope of beating me now. Even if I don't have the strength to beat him, I'll eventually wear him down. <laughs> okay, here goes. What the? The dragons disappeared. The Dragon Balls, they're, they're stone. G Grand Elder Guru, he's gone. He finally... died. What, what do you mean? The, what about my immortality? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> uh, oh no. It's Frieza! Well, you've really done it now, haven't you? You have destroyed my dream of attaining true immortality in the most spectacular fashion. As for the lack of response from the Ginyu Force, I suppose I have you to blame. I don't fully understand what has happened, but this is a rather surprising turn of events. How could I have foreseen the Dragon Balls turning to stone just as I was about to make my wish a reality? I can only imagine Vegeta's disappointment, though it pales in comparison to my own. This is a first, to be sure. No one has ever been foolish enough to make a mockery of me on such a grand scale. Y you You worms will pay for this! I'm going to make your deaths long and painful! None of you will escape my wrath! Prepare to experience hell! We're... we're doomed! What is his power level? There's no way we can beat someone like this! Of course. Did you really think three measly ants could defeat a dinosaur? We can beat you! There's enough power between the three of us to take you down! The power level of those two keep rising, and the kid still has a ton of untapped power ready to go! Not to mention, I'm getting even closer to becoming your worst nightmare, a Super Saiyan! I grow tired of hearing about that preposterous myth. Please, you are no Super Saiyan. <laughs> it's no myth. I'm strong enough now to take on even that freakish transformation of yours. Transformation? Did you say transformations? What are you talking about, Vegeta? A small number of people throughout the universe have the ability to transform when needed. Some camouflage themselves with it, while other beings use it to conserve their energy. My transformation serves another purpose, I'm afraid. You see, my power is so great that I struggle to contain it at times. What did you just say? He's bluffing! Relax! He doesn't have that much power! Oh, you think so? You know, I recall when I took over Planet Vegeta. I hadn't a need to transform in order to subdue you simian barbarians. <laughs> and your king. That's right, Vegeta. Your planet was nothing special. Not even your father. 
I wouldn't be so cocky if I were you. My father's strength back then pales in comparison to mine now. Huh. So it was Frieza that destroyed the Saiyan planet. Go on, transform. Show us what you really look like, Frieza. <laughs> Very well. If you wish to die that badly, then I'm more than happy to oblige. You're in for a rare treat. Not many have had the privilege of seeing this form. His power level, it's insane! <laughs> Careful now. This won't be like before, and I won't be gentle. Perhaps you've noticed my massive increase in power. In terms of power level, I would say it's over one million. What? No way! <laughs> oh my, you look rather scared, Vegeta. What's wrong? You weren't expecting this? For me to be this powerful? Damn you, Frieza! Now then, who shall I send to hell first? What about you? <laughs> I was gonna say, like, I don't remember Frieza transforming to, like, his, I guess, like, the normal form? You know, his pure white form. Right away. I was like, I saw he doesn't have another form between us. I forgot about this one. Okay, okay, okay. Woo, that does a lot of damage, but... With Vegeta, man, we are doing... Doing work. It's fine, it's fine. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Right, quick, quick, quick. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Thanks, Vegeta. You did that. I, even, I was gonna, like... There you go. Vegeta, finish him off. Nice. Wasn't actually too difficult. of yours just now actually managed to hurt but you are no match for me all you've succeeded in doing is angering me further oh, it's no use damn it so much for that plan of ours the energy from before is larger now frieza appears to have finally made his move <gasps> there's an energy nearby <laughs> he looks just like me. Must be Namekian. So, you're the Namekian the Earthlings were talking about. They got their wish. <laughs> Good for them. You seem to know a lot about what's going on. You probably also know these Earthlings called me here to help them, not to talk to the locals. Sorry, but you're on your own. I don't know what kind of training you put yourself through, but your power, it's unbelievable. <clears throat> Too bad it's not enough. You... you might have actually been able to take on Frieza if you recombined with your other half. What? You mean I could stand a chance against Frieza if I fused back together with Kami? Is that what you're telling me? That's right. I was no match for Frieza. But I... 
I got a sense of his power. There's no way in hell I'd join back with that dried up dolt. Besides, I couldn't even if I wanted to. <laughs> then, then fuse with me. If you do, you'll increase your power tenfold, maybe more. What? Fuse with you? There's not much time. I only have a few moments left. Your mind will still be your own. Quickly, place your hand on my body. Fine. I'll do it. Make Frieza suffer for what he did to our people. Oh, I'm planning on it. This... this is unreal. This power... it's unbelievably incredible. So... so this is what he was talking about. I'm on my way, Gohan. Uh, what's he good in? Uh, he's pretty average in everything. Cool. Might be an adventure. All right. Piccolo now level twenty nine. We got some upgrade doing that Piccolo a hundred percent. Stand in my way now. All right, community board. Uh, I started actually like upgrading a little bit. As you can see, we're looking pretty good. What's close to ranking up? Not really anything. Um, I guess I could probably put you. Hey, she might get a bonus potentially with the guru. No. Right, anyway, I think that's probably a good place to end this episode off. The next episode, I think it's probably going to be the final, the ultimate power and the ultimate life form. Uh, we're going to pretty finish the the freezer Namek arc. Probably end up, you know, getting a lot of battles in and going Super Saiyan. Can't wait to see that scene again. So good. But thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.